Today on CGO Off-Road, we're going to show you how to make your Raptor breathe a whole lot better with some help from AFE. The F-150 Raptor is a great truck right from the factory and makes a ton of power, but there's always room for improvement, so today we're going to be installing this AFE cold air intake on our 2017 Raptor. This is AFE's Momentum XP Pro Dry S cold air intake designed to fit the 2017-18 F-150 Raptor. It features two high-flow texture black powder-coated mandrel bent tubes with a massive dry air filter protected by a high-flow rotomoted housing. It comes with everything you need to make the install a breeze and to give your Raptor a more custom look and improved performance. For more information and pricing, click the link in the description down below. Now let's get to the install. Tools you will need for this installation, 7mm socket, 8mm socket, quarter inch ratchet, 11mm socket, 13mm socket, 3 8 ratchet, and a trim panel removal tool. So we actually currently have an AFE intake on this truck, so we can't show you how to remove the factory intake right this second with this truck. So we're going to show you footage from a previous install on how to remove the factory intake, and then we'll install our new AFE intake. Disconnect the two clips on the factory air box. Then there's two 7mm clamps on the air intake. This one's pretty easy to get to, but the next one's kind of hard to see. Once you get that clamp loosened, the upper portion of the intake can come right off. Unplug this intake sensor and then set your intake aside. There's a 13 millimeter bolt that secures the lower portion of the air box that needs to be removed. Remove the five plastic clips from the air box. The air box can now pop right off. With the factory system removed, take the grommet from the factory air box and put it onto your new AFE air box. Then take this metal sleeve and install it into the grommet from the inside. Install your AFE air box into the factory location. Place the factory bolt through the grommet that you just installed and thread it in. To make this easier, you are going to want some extensions in a 13 millimeter socket. Take the provided rubber trim and install this around the edge of the air inlet of the air box. And this will make for a nice tight seal against the hood. Then we can install our two clips right here. Grab the massive air filter and install it into the air box. Just like that. Install the three to four inch coupler on the driver's side inlet pipe. Install another clamp onto the coupler. Install the shorter pipe that comes with the kit onto the driver's side inlet tube. Install the other coupler onto the passenger side inlet tube with both clamps. Install the intake temperature sensor onto the other inlet tube that comes with the kit. Twist it to lock it in place. Get it into this coupler. And then into the air filter. Install the crossover tube onto the bottom of the intakes. Now you can go back and tighten all the clamps. And we are done. Okay, we got our AFE cold air intake installed in our 2017 Raptor and I'm loving the way it looks. It looks way better than the factory intake but the texture black isn't over the top or anything crazy. I'd say give yourself an hour, maybe an hour and a half to do this and before you know it, you'll be heading off road. We hope you enjoyed this video. To subscribe to our YouTube channel, click the link right here and for more videos like this one, check out this playlist.